All right, Shalom Yasharala, peace Israel. First and foremost, I would like to give all praises on and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rakah, Kadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule well and who has taught us this truth. And also peace and salutation to the hopeful elect out here laboring in truth and sincerity in the four corners of the earth under the standard and the banner of Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rakah, Kadash. Yahweh being the name of the Heavenly Father, who people ignorantly call God. All right. Uh, Bahashim is in the name Yahweh Shai, uh, being the, the the only begotten Son of the Heavenly Father, who people ignorantly call Jesus Christ, but truly His name is Yahweh Shai. All right, Bahashim, once again is in the name Waka Kodash. So Waka being Spirit, Kodash being Holy. So it's the Holy Spirit, and that was said in Alashwan Kodash, which is the Holy Tongue, which is the Paleo Hebrew, and that word Paleo goes back to the ancient Hebrew. All right, this is the brother Karab here from the GMS Boston camp. I uh, just want to touch on a quick lesson, and Lord's will that this lesson is edifying. And this lesson is going to jump into this article uh, revolved around the the recent situation that happened in Philly with the, the Jake being shot by the police officer. All right, and now you're seeing that uh, once again, you know, you're seeing people uh, rioting, you know, going crazy, they're protesting, but not just only protesting, they're rioting, looting, doing the same old thing that was happening uh, in the top of the year. In the beginning, like midway through the year, uh, with the George Floyd incident, all right, and they don't see that Esau Edom has already set the stage to come down with great wrath, all right. But but it's showing you that a lot of uh, a lot of Jakes take part of those riots and and, and, and those protests just to uh, gain a come up or just to 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 to, to um, get active in wickedness, you know, to to to, to show forth their wickedness, all right, and. When you have a bunch of jakes out there, all uh, just just being uh, uh, you know being crazy and acting crazy and, and, and acting like brute beasts, you know you're gonna they're gonna that's that's empowering one another to 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 to, to you know what's what would be considered like peer pressure, you know that's empowering one another to to continue to do wickedness or top the next uh, top the wickedness that the person before them or the person uh, in front of them that just did. All right, there was a video that I seen. A man uh, jumped in a brand new 2020 Corvette and sped off. You know what I'm saying? Fresh, fresh off the uh, the lot. You know, we're showing you Jake is Jake is is bugged out and Jake is gonna get uh, destroyed. All right. So so with the situation that happened with uh, what's his name? Uh, Walter Wallace Jr. All right. All right. It's, it's it's many more of that's gonna happen. All right. Because Jake is too involved and too and too and too too comfortable in them doing wickedness. They're too you know they 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 love the filth. All right, they love the filth. They don't want to get right. All right, so that's the they, they exercise that 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 the 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 chance to do wickedness by going to these protests. But you know, I'm uh, I'm gonna just jump straight into the article, and it says Walter Wallace Jr., the knife wielding black man, all right, which he's the Israelite. All right, gunned down by Philadelphia police had violent criminal past right, reports. All right, and Esau always does that. Whenever they kill Jake or they do something to Jake, they always go into their past history. All right. But hey, that doesn't that doesn't take away from the fact that you know judgment was laid out unto him, you know, by way of the heavenly father using Esau Edom. All right. And it says the black man shot and killed by uh, Philadelphia police on Monday, Walter Wallace Jr., had a long criminal record that include violent offenses. Local media have reported Wallace's death had led to riots in the city. Uh, it says the 27-year-old was fatally shot by a police officer after he reportedly ignored commands to drop a knife that he was holding, all right? So he brought that upon himself, all right? There's, there's ways to deal with the police officers. There's ways to deal with situations that, that way uh, you may retain and keep your life, all right? It's written in the scriptures. It's written in the scriptures. The Lord said in Matthew, the fifth chapter, it says, agree with thy adversary quickly, all right? And, and that doesn't mean just, you know, that, that doesn't mean take matters into your own hand and try to act a certain way, act the ass towards them, you know. It means to, 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 to just try to smooth things out so you can get go on about your business, all right? Go about your way, all right? But Jake, they don't have the understanding of it. They don't turn to the scriptures. They don't, they don't believe in the scriptures. And if they believe, they don't apply it. So they lack wisdom, all right? They lack wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, all right? So the incident sparked large protests in Philadelphia, which quickly descended into rioting and looting. Sympathetic media reports have portrayed Wallace as a husband, father, and aspiring musician who struggled to overcome mental health issues. But courts document uh, obtained by news outlet 
revealed he had numerous run-ins with the law. In 2017, Wallace pled guilty to robbery and assault after kicking kicking door kicking down the door of a woman and putting her putting a gun to her head. Fox News reported four years earlier he pled guilty to assault and resisting arrest after punching a police officer in the face. All right, and it says, uh, "I heard this young man. This is a tweet from from uh, this girl. You know, like a uh, Israelite girl." Uh, it says, uh, I heard that this young man had autism and was suffering from a breakdown. Please investigate this and be transparent. It says, uh, PA court records show that Wallace had been arrested no less than 10 times since 2013, including five felony convictions, ranging from burglary to aggravated assault and terrorist threat, um, terroristic threatening. All right. And it says, according to the Philadelphia inquirers, uh, police have responded to a dozens of call in a recent month that involved disturbance at Wallace's home and they had even visit visited the address twice on Monday before returning again for the third time which led to the fatal incident his family claimed that the third call to emergency service that day was for an ambulance to help Wallace in this uh, a psycho psychotic episode and it says uh but that but that the police arrived instead uh, police, police Commissioner Daniel Outlaw said on Tuesday that it was not clear if the two officers who shot Wallace were aware of his condition or criminal background. All right, a relative previous told uh, a, a relative's like a relative previously told Fox News that Wallace had struggled with mental health is issues and was bipolar, and he was at one stage he was at one stage ordered by a judge to undergo psychiatric evaluation treatment and the news station reported family members have stated that Wallace was bipolar a local ABC affiliate report that Wallace had been ordered by a judge to undergo uh, undergo a psychiatric evaluation in 2013 all right so I'm gonna just stop there but all right so but even that like I know Esau Esau is bloodthirsty Esau is waiting for any opportunity to lay Jake out and that's the point of it Like you know But it shows that With all the recent situations that happened You got the Breonna Taylor You have uh, 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 George Floyd And so on and so forth You know This should, this should, this should give uh, uh, Jake an idea Or a way of Trying to escape the clutches of Esau Edom Man the devil Alright Because you know what's gonna happen If you If, 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 if you get pulled over Or if you get A uh, 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 you know, in contact with a, with a, with a, with a, with an eat of my officer. All right, and you also probably have some Jake officers that that that's 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 willing to turn up. All right, do the same, but primarily Esau eat them because they're the devil. They're the so called uh, they're the so called uh, so called white man is the devil that the Bible speaks of. All right, and the Lord and they're known as the sword. All right, so it's showing you that there's ways to go about it, man. You know, but Jake once again, you know, with all this happening out here. They want to go and and, 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 and and showcase their folly and showcase their wickedness, all right. And now knowing that, but ultimately it's because there's no there's no uh there's no understanding, there's no judgment, all right. So you have uh Jake out here protesting, but hey, all, all, the National Guards was called in to Philadelphia, which uh because of the uh rioting and looting, all right. And this is what the scripture says, man. Exodus twenty three and two. It says, "Thou shalt not follow a multitude to do evil." All right, and that's plain. That's he says, "Thou shalt not follow a multitude to do evil. Thou shalt not follow a group of people to do wickedness and do evil. Looting and rioting is evil. That's wickedness, man. All right, that has nothing that 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 that's, that's, that has there's nothing there for you to do, man. That's nothing there for for you to be involved with because what's going to uh, uh, be the outcome of that is going to be death. All right, how much more when the national guards is out there and Jake Jake still out there trying to loot and riot and try to act a fool." If you see what's happening in uh in Nigeria, those police officers sh shooting and killing those protesters. It's going to happen here. And and now it's crazy because and it, we only have a few more days. All right? We have a few more days until the the the, the election. All right? So Esau is going to try to make an example. All right? He's going to try to make an example out of Jake. All right? So going back uh Ex Exodus 20 23 and 2 it says thou shalt not follow a multitude to do evil neither shalt thou speak in the cause to decline after many to rest judgment all right so jake shouldn't shouldn't be out there man they shouldn't be taking part of that all right because what's gonna happen is judgment's gonna lay out all right and ultimately you know 
two thirds is going to be a part of that. You might have a, a person that's part of the one third out of it, but ultimately he's going to come out of those ways if that person is in that in, in that realm, in, in that in that in that uh, that setting. That person going to uh, take themselves out, all right, and they're going to get right. They're going to seek the the, the the better way. All right, which is the scriptures. All right, but ultimately you're gonna have two thirds that's gonna go out there. You're gonna have two thirds that's out there uh, stealing because that's all they're into. That's what they know. All right. So going to uh, next precept, we we'll go to Zephaniah three and five, all right, and it reads the the just Lord Yahweh is in the midst thereof. He will not do iniquity. Every morning do he bring forth his bring slaki. Every morning do he bring his judgment to light. He faileth not, but the unjust. North, no shame. All right. So every morning, the Lord Yahweh Bashim Al Shah bringing his uh, judgment to light, man. All right. What happened to the, the guy Walter, the twenty-seven year old? That was judgment. What's gonna happen to these people uh, that's out there acting a fool? If they don't get, if they don't, if they don't repent, it's gonna be judgment, and it's gonna be known. It's gonna be broadcast across the whole earth, man. It's gonna be broadcast on the news. All right. Just like how the uh, the, the protests and the riot is pro um, broadcast on the news, it's showing you that. This is this is this is this is what's happening. This is the time that we're coming into, the time of Jacob's trouble, as the scripture talks about. Jacob pertaining unto you so-called blacks, Hispanics, Native and Seminole Indians, man. This is what it is, man. And it but once again, they have no knowledge, they have no they have no common sense. Which Jeremiah 4 and 22, you know, 4 and 22 goes into it. And it says, for my people is foolish, they have no, they have not known me. Alright, because if you had known Yahweh Bashim Al Shah, you would know his ways. And you would know how to walk, how to deal with the situations that are at hand. You will know not to follow a multitude to, uh, to, to do evil. You will know to stay away from the ungodly, stay away from wicked. Uh, because at, at the end of the day, if you if you revolve yourself or you involve yourself in that that setting, you're liable of getting judged with that person or with the people in that setting. Alright? So this is a prime example of uh, how you not like you you don't know the ways of your about Shimei was shot. All right. Once again, verse 22 says, For my people is foolish, they have not known me. They are sought as children, they have none understanding. So they have they lack understanding, right? They are wise to do evil, but to do good, they have no knowledge. All right, and they're wise to do evil. Some people will say they're doing it for the cause, and some people just out there just to just to be out there. All right, some people are out there just to be out there. All right, and that's and that's and that's what it is, man. At the end of the day, if you understood the Lord's judgment, hey, man, this wouldn't be taking place, man. You you would sit back, and and, 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 and you you it would put it should put fear in, in, in that individual person to seek your Hashem Al Shah ten times more. All right, because that's the purpose of judgment. The judgment is it's a is to to show uh, uh, people what not to do. All right, because this is the outcome. All right, but once again. Jake is sottish Jake is foolish They don't want to know nothing They don't want to know The ways of Yahweh Bashim El Shah Alright Let me go to My next precept Go to Ecclesiastes And this is the This is the part That trips them up Alright What is it 8 and 5 Yep Ecclesiastes 8 and 5 And it reads Whoso keepeth the commandments Alright shall, fi shall feel no evil thing Alright So if you keep the law Statute of commandments And follow the ways Of Yahweh Bashim El Shah Hey, it says that you should feel no evil thing. All right? Because what's on the other side of it? If you do wicked, you're going to receive according to your works. You're going to receive the judgment according to your work. You're going to receive a reward according to your works. All right? So whoso keepeth the commandment shall feel no evil thing. And a wise man heart discerneth both time and judgment. So a wise man heart is going to discern the times. You know what time that we're in. You know that 2020, the year of prophecy that's coined by our Apostle Taha, you know, uh, it's been, it's been, it's been hitting. Prophecy's been hitting. Look at what happened with the George Floyd thing. Look at what happened to Breonna Taylor. You seen what happened with the protests and the riots and the burning of the buildings and 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 and, and, and Tifa and Black Lives Matter going crazy. You, 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 they're certain the times, knowing the time that we're in. So it, it makes sense for you to walk a different way. It only makes sense for you to walk a different way So that, that, that applies wisdom, knowledge, understanding, discernment And all those key things that, that, that you will be guided by the scriptures Alright um, Once again, verse 5 Whoso keepeth the commandment shall feel no evil thing And a wise man hard discerneth both time and judgment Because to every purpose there is a time and judgment Alright, for every purpose is a time and judgment Therefore the misery of a man is great upon him 
For he knoweth not that which shall be, for who can tell him when it shall be? So uh, who can tell that person when that time of judgment is going to hit? It's just hit when it when in due time. All right, it may, it's, but it's not going to be a time where you're going to know. All right, only time you're going to know is when it actually happens. All right. Now I say uh, I'm gonna jump down. All right, let me jump down to verse eleven. It says because sentence against against the evil work is not executed speedily. All right, and this even goes towards uh the the, the guy that uh the the, the twenty seven year old Walter what's his name Walter Wallace. All right, this even goes towards him because he had a a a a, a, a what was it um uh, a criminal past you know he had a criminal past but judgment wasn't executed speedily right then and there. All right, it happened right when it happened, which was a couple days ago. All right, and this is this is the understanding of. Yahweh Shemel Shah. If you know that just because you do something, it's not going to hit you right there on the spot. The Lord's going to uh, let things play out. He's going to give you an opportunity to either make a make it up or make you build a, uh, make it up, which is to repent, or He's going to make you build that tab up. The option is yours. All right. And it says because it, sentence against the evil work is not executed speedily, therefore the heart of the heart of the sons of men. It's fully set in them to do evil, all right? And just because they seen that these people was protesting, rioting, looting before, what they going to do? And they seen that they got away with it, what they going to do? They're going to do the same thing. If Esau, if, if, if Esau would have came out with them, um, them uh, what was it, them, them, them 50 calibers and mold Jake down, you wouldn't see that. If, 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 if the Lord would have brought swift judgment upon these people at that time, you probably wouldn't see uh, 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 people out there pro uh, protesting, rioting, and looting, acting a fool. But ultimately, that's that's the reason why it's happening because Jake out here is wicked for one and two. The Lord is gonna the Lord's gonna deal with them in due time. All right, so that's why it's, it, 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 it'll, it'll be smart for anyone that's watching that that wants to take part of that to stay out of it, man. Stay out of it and and, and go the opposite way, man. It says, um, you know, it talks about that that, wa that, that, that wide and broad way that leadeth unto destruction, but that straight and narrow path leadeth unto life. Go to the, go to straight and narrow way, man. Follow the ways of the Lord, man. That's the purpose of, of uh, that's what it says uh, Ecclesiastes 12 and, and 13. The duty of man is to keep the, fear the, to fear the most high and keep the commandments. All right? Fear, you got to fear Yahweh Bashim El Shah. Once you fear Yahweh Bashim El Shah, you know that he sees everything. He, he, he acknowledges everything. He doesn't, yo. He even what you do in in, in what you would what you would say is is hidden. He knows already. All right, even your thoughts. So so you got to get right. But if you don't, ultimately judgment is going to take place and it's going to befall you. All right, verse twelve. Though a sinner do evil a hundred times and his days be prolonged, yet surely I know that it shall be well with them that fear Yahweh, which fear before Him. All right. See, it says though a sinner do I'm gonna read it again Verse 12 Though a sinner do evil A hundred times And his days be prolonged Which means he gotta like, it, it still continues on He's not judged right Right then and there Yet surely I know That it shall be well With them that fear Yahweh Ba'a Shem Shai So it's gonna be well With you that fear the Lord Alright Just because you see this man Constantly doing wickedness Stealing, robbing uh, doing, doing harm to people Alright Hey, but it says it's gonna be well with those that fear Yahweh Bashim El Shah, which fear before him, but it shall not be well with the wicked. Neither shall he prolong his days, which are as as a shadow, because he feareth not before Yahweh Bashim El Shah. All right. So what is that? He said the wicked is gonna get judged, and that's what it is. You know, they might think they 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 by their wickedness they're able to prolong and live a long life. Hey, man, there's no there's no there's no life or there's no uh, extension of life by living in wickedness, man. Life is by living righteously, man. Life is trying to strive to, to live righteously. Uh, that's why the scripture told you uh, when, when Moses said, Choose ye this day life or death. I'd rather you choose life, roughly paraphrasing. All right? So so, so by way of the ways of Yahweh Bashim El Shai, is how we choose life, man. All right? But as you see what's going on in the world, Jake out here turned up once again. And it's all because they lack knowledge, wisdom, understanding. They they don't understand judgment because if they knew that this was judgment from Yahweh Shemel Shah, they wouldn't they 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 wouldn't be taking these uh they wouldn't be going down this route. All right, but ultimately they don't they don't they don't believe in Yahweh Shemel Shah. All right, they believe in they believe in Shazaway Borzir. All right, that's what they believe in. 
They oh they believe in Islam or they believe in everything else outside of the Heavenly Father. So that shows that there's no fear of the Heavenly Father. Yahweh Bashim El Shah. Alright. So you know that's all I have, you know. Going into that, you know, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shah, Bahashim, Makar Kadash. Double honor to the uh, apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule well once again. And also peace and salutation to the hopeful elect out here laboring in truth and sincerity on the four corners of the earth under the standard and the banner of Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shah, Bahashim, Makar Kadash. Right, with that, I want to say Shalom, Ababa, Kwam Yasharala.